Taiping, set in Peninsula Malaysia, with its ever-changing weather conditions, is the perfect location to put the Triton to a 24-hour challenge. Hi, I'm Leona Chin, Malaysian motorsports athlete. In the first episode, we have witnessed how Mr. Ayai has put his Triton through tough conditions and terrains in his line of work. Today, we will be taking that benchmark up a notch and putting the Triton through a test, a 24-hour challenge under extreme heat and tough terrains. And to top up that challenge, we will be loading the Triton with palm oil produce up to one ton gradually within the 24-hour challenge. Let's see if the Triton can withstand all challenges, shall we? To prove the durability and endurance of the Triton, heat, humidity and unforgiving payload on tough terrain is all the variables that the Triton has to endure through the next 24 hours. In the first six hours, the Triton endured the rough plantation terrains without any payload. But, it wasn't going to be all that easy. The Triton is pushed as hard as it could through the mixed surface course. From loose gravel to tarmac, the Triton proves itself a worthy challenger thanks to the award-winning 2.4-liter Myvac turbo diesel engine. So powerful and lightweight, making all the tough terrains seem easy. With the driver changes on an hourly basis and the weather took a turn with fast approaching scattered tropical rain, the course is now wet with challenging slippery roads in certain sectors in the course. With the easy select four-wheel drive system, the constant changing road surface is no obstacle for the Triton. At 6 p.m., the crews begin loading the first 500 kilograms palm oil into the truck bed. With the engineers performing routine inspection and monitoring, the real challenge for the Triton now begins as the sun sets over the mountains. On the 12th hour, the car pits in for a total 800 kg payload and additional 300 kg of palm oil was added before sending the car into the pitch black night stint once again. With poor visibility and 800 kg payload, the drivers meticulously navigate through the test course under the watchful eye of the support vehicles. Any wrong move now could potentially jeopardize the challenge. It's currently the break of dawn and down to the final six hours. The moment of truth has finally arrived. The Triton will now be loaded with a total payload of 1,000 kg with the final 200 kilograms of palm oil. With 181 PS maximum power and 430 Newton meters maximum torque, the Triton resumes the journey instantly without the hurdle of the extra load on the truck bed. It would prove to be a real challenge not only for the Triton, but also for the drivers that has to endure the mental and physical stress after the long night. Finally, after 24 grueling hours, the Triton crossed the finishing line with Leona behind the wheels, clocking a total of 536.3 kilometers of endurance challenge, all without any technical or overheating problems. Once again, the Triton has proved its durability and endurance capability when it is subjected to the harshest environment. Ultimate Mitsubishi Triton is here, a rare breed, built to go further, to go harder, to go all out, to look mean as, and deliver the goods off-road. The new Mitsubishi Triton Hunterway. It's only for the brave and strictly limited with just 20 available. If you don't catch it now, you won't see it for dust.
the new Mitsubishi Triton Hunterway. Built to go further and all for just 69,990 plus on roads. Hi, I'm Leona Chin, Malaysian motorsports athlete, and I have a question for you. What can you get for 35 ringgit per day? Well, you can get two artisans' coffees or one tub of premium ice cream. You can also get Tada! The new and affordable Mitsubishi Triton VGT Auto GL. Mitsubishi is known for its Dakar Rally heritage with years of winning experience in the grueling course. This makes them the specialists in rugged four-wheel drive vehicles. So their pickup truck is also built based on this rally platform. Good handling, lightweight and very responsive. This affordable new Triton VGT Auto GL has superb handling. Although with such huge body size, this Triton comes with the best in class turning radius of 5.9 meters, making it easy to maneuver and conquer any tight corners. The Triton is powered by the same 2.4 liter MyVec Turbo diesel engine found in the higher variants. This engine is the first full aluminium engine in a pickup truck and also the most powerful in its class, producing 181 PS of power and 430 newton meters of torque. The lightweight engine also comes with variable valve timing technology to optimize efficiency and improve overall performance, so you can get more powerful more fuel efficient and more quiet cabin for maximum driving pleasure. On to safety aspects, the new and affordable Triton VGT Auto GL has got you covered with optimum safety features such as active stability and traction control, hill start assist, trailer stability assist and easy select four-wheel drive to name a few. This Triton VGT Auto GL also has a strong chassis that's capable for loads up to one ton due to its robust and tough frame, making it the most reliable workhorse you can get. The Triton is the only pickup offering 200,000 kilometers or five years warranty in its class, giving you a peace of mind ownership experience. The periodic maintenance cost is also equivalent to a sedan vehicle. How good is that? All in all, the Triton status as an all-rounder pickup truck is sealed with a warranty that's unparalleled in the segment. If you're looking for an affordable and reliable workhorse for all your needs, this newly introduced Triton VGT Auto GL is the pickup for you. Once again, I welcome you all to the Triton Media Drive for 2017. Today we're over at Kota Belut. We have been driving the Triton uh, with MyVec technology right now. So far, it's been quite interesting to see how it's been performing. Pretty nice, smooth performance on the low RPMs, and then if you need more, it just gives you more power and you put your foot down on it. But so far, it's been a very uh, interesting experience. Bagi saya, pemanduan Triton baru ni adalah sempurna kita memandu semua kendaraan kereta. Jadi uh, pemanduan di luar jalan bagi saya amat lancar dan antara aspek yang menarik perhatian saya adalah dari segi pengendalian dia lah terutama pada bahagian steering eh, yang mudah untuk dikendalikan selain uh, dengan sistem uh, four wheel automatiknya yang begitu mudah untuk kita kendalikan ketika kita berada di luar jalan lah. Cara keseluruhan saya menganggap uh, Triton ni antara top 3 lah uh, uh, dalam pasaran tempatan. Triton has been quite capable. It's got a new MyVec engine, so it's very torquey and also quite uh, refined. The new upgrades of the car definitely make it quite compelling. It's now got seven airbags on the top spec and stability control, which makes it quite a good buy in the segment, in my opinion. There's a lot of features in the car, a lot of convenience features in the car that really make it stand out. 
I've I've driven other pickup trucks before. Uh, you name the brands, and I've, I've driven them all. And this one is much smoother. Power delivery is there, and very talky, comfortable. Uh, we've been driving for a few hours since 10 a.m. this morning, and I haven't felt tired yet. <laughs> What's really impressive about this truck is that it can just take all the punishment that we are giving it over this kind of rough terrain that you see around here. You know? It's nice terrain, but to get up here is really tough. And I think Mitsubishi has always done a good job with its trucks. So the 200,000 kilometer five year warranty is probably not necessary for most owners because this truck will last a longer time than five years without breaking down. So, good job Mitsubishi, once again. Pendapat saya, uh, yang antara benda yang ketara saya rasakan pada model baru ni, ia lebih ringan satu. Uh, terutama kalau masa lalu jalan off-road tadi, uh, walaupun lecak atau uh, tak rata dia agak senang untuk kita kawal. Itu so, kalau dalam atas jalan biasa, on-road biasa dengan BSC, kaw, uh, sistem kawalan kestabilan semua, saya rasa dia tak terlambat susah lagi dah nak bawa pick up truck, sangat mudah. Dan saya rasa kenapa saya rasa ringan tadi terjawab sebab blok engine yang digunakan sekarang ini untuk ini yang first uh, sekali sepenuhnya aluminium. Jadi keseluruhannya saya difahamkan bawah 2 tan berat kereta ni. Jadi sangat senang untuk bawa off-road atau mana-mana permukaan tak ada masalah.